But we could solve this confusion if we tried instead of shooting. Plus, there's no excuse when we have mouths and could use them for apologizing and acknowledging fault instead of falsely accusing, making threats, shouting, and verbally abusing. You see, we could blame race because it's easy and it's legal, but the one common denominator, people, is people. It's a people problem. People, when there's love, you feel the other person's heartbeat, and that heart becomes something that you want to take care of. And this is what we're lacking. The problem is not money or the lack thereof. The problem is people doing evil things to get it and evil things with it. Humility has totally left us. The reason I'm here is to help you, help me, help us. It's a people problem. People? It's simple and plain. People purposely impose upon others their misery and pain. Their primary motive and mission is to spread their anger and displeasure and to put other people in their position. They plot. They practice illegal tactics. They play a game of pretend. And the problem is not time. They have plenty of that to spend. The problem is people once again. It's a people problem. People? Now, to some degree, we're all born equal, and then our thoughts, beliefs, and opinions are shaped and altered by, guess who? You guessed it, people. And to say there's a drug problem without acknowledging the source won't help because no drug can manufacture and ship itself. And the problem is not, I said not, the internet. The problem is people who neglect priorities and lack self-respect. And if it wasn't for people, there would be no war. Guns and knives are not killers. People are. It's a people problem. People.